Well, I'm glad you're watching this YouTube because I am sitting with the president of Taurus right here, Brett Voorhees. We've had a blast, but he has got the brand new GX4 with him. Super excited to shoot this. This is an 11 plus one. So you're literally 12 rounds is what you could be going with. Nine millimeter, tons of cool features. But one of the coolest features to me is how easily this gun breaks down using all kinds of tools. So first, real quick, if you would, talk about some of the really neat features about this GX4, and then we're gonna show you how easily it is to take down and how you can do it with anything from one of your nine millimeter bullets to a knife, an iPhone cord, all kinds of different stuff. Sure. So yeah, this is a, like you said, extremely small, micro compact pistol with a high capacity magazine. So 11 plus one uh, standard magazine, 13 plus one is an option for a little bit of an extended magazine. Really nice, high quality pistol that doesn't break the bank, uh, which is really what we stand for at Taurus. Uh, great trigger, it's a very short take up on the trigger. It's uh, just under six pounds, uh, which is really what you want for a carry gun. Short reset, so your follow-up shots are gonna be extremely quick. Um, just a great all-around pistol. Um, Got adjustable sights, I know that. Yep, yeah, so you can change these sights out. There's there's endless options for the uh, aftermarket for whatever sights that you decide you want. If you wanna put night sights on there, fiber, fiber optic front sight, those type of things exist. Um, the texturing on the, on the frame and the ergonomics of it uh, make it extremely uh, comfortable to carry, but also very functional if you do uh, go shoot it at the range, those type of things. Um, and just overall, it's a very simple pistol to operate. Uh, it works really well. It's very reliable. We've tested it, you know, at a high round count, 20,000 rounds endurance tests. 20,000. Um, but the gun works. It runs wide range of ammo. Everything that you, that you need this pistol to do, it's going to do. And a new coating that you were explaining that actually goes into... Correct. The metal, correct. So right? it's a gas nitride uh, coating on the slide, DLC finish on the on the barrel. Uh, but that slide and barrel combination is going to provide a lot of things: corrosion resistance, abrasion resistance. They're both very hard uh, surface treatments. Um, and then the combination of them is a very uh, slick, uh, so it reduces a lot of the friction when the slide reciprocates on the pistol. So uh, really good combination of finishes on those two parts. Um, but then, you know, getting back to the simplicity of the gun and making it user friendly, the takedown is really, really cool. So, uh, this, on is, this, gun, this is neat to me. I got to point this out. And of course, make sure your handguns are unloaded. Double check them. Right. That's huge. Uh, you know, Taurus preaches that in everything, not only all the, you know, literature that you guys put out, but every video I've ever seen. So of course, make sure you're being super safe with your handgun. But to me, this is one of the neatest features. I've had handguns before that I had to watch YouTube videos because they were sure. so tough. And like, you have to watch it in slow-mo and you back up and watch a guy break it down. Watch how easily, not only this gun takes down, but how easily it goes back. So first thing you do, just remove the magazine. You wanna make sure you, there's no ammunition source available. So set that to the side, right? I got right? the mag here. You're gonna, of course, check the chamber, make sure there's no, uh, no ammunition present in the gun. You do need to pull the trigger to release the striker, uh, which is kind of standard in, in these type of guns. So pointing the firearm in a safe direction, you're gonna release that striker forward. So the next step is this little slot right here. Just uh, this one little. Trigger. You can see how it's vertical, and that means it's in the locked position. You need to turn it a quarter of a turn counterclockwise. So you can use a flathead screwdriver. It fits in the, in the slot perfectly. But if you don't happen to have a flathead screwdriver, you can use the rim of a nine millimeter, and it and comes it right off. And it just pops off. When you reassemble the pistol, and you rack the slide back, the slot Boom. goes back to the lock position. If for whatever reason it doesn't, you want to visually check it. If it's not, you can just turn it uh, clockwise, quarter of a turn, and it will work. So again, releasing the striker, you can use an iPhone cord. Fits in that slot perfect. Turns, just like that. Slide comes off just like that. What did that take? Second and a half? I don't yeah, even know. We're going to have to time that. It's, extre <laughs> it's extremely easy to use. Um, you know, it's not a specialized tool. Of course, everyone has a flathead screwdriver. That's right. it's standard. But if you don't happen to have a screwdriver on you, then, you know, what are you going to use? You can use endless amounts of uh, household appliances. I've used a paper clip before. 
there's all sorts of options. And you're not so. jamming your thumb like I've got a, you know, right. I've and got an old 1911 that I'm like, you know, it's one of my dad's old guns that I'm like, ah, you're jamming it. You're right, you know, and you're not, you're not holding the slide back with one hand, pulling the tab down with the other. Um, it's just really simple and easy to easy to operate, and that's really what we wanted out of this out of this gun. Such a great idea! Check out the new GX4 from Taurus. What's pretty? What really sold me is Brett said. I said, "What did you? What do you carry?" And he goes, "Fred, this is going to be my new carry. Pretty incredible. A lot of firepower and a super easy carry handgun. Yes, sir. Pretty awesome. Thanks, man. Thank you."